Today I'm going to teach you the five positions of the pentatonic scale so you can solo all over the neck just like John Frusciante. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Just before we get into today's video, if you could hit the subscribe button, it would mean a lot. 90% of people that are watching my videos aren't actually subscribed, so it would help me a lot if you could do that for me. So today I'm going to be teaching you the five positions of the pentatonic scale, so you can solo all over the neck in any key, any time. Today we're going to be using D minor or F major for the purposes of this video, as it's John's favourite key. So first of all, I'm going to teach you the five positions of the scale, then at the end I'm going to show you a lick that you can learn to join up all five scales. It helped me out a lot. So let's get into it. Here's the five positions of the D minor or F major pentatonic scale. So that was the five positions of the pentatonic scale. It can be kind of hard to join these up at the start and you kind of get lost on the neck and you don't know where you're going. So the best thing you can do is put on a backing track in D minor and just play around up and down the scales and eventually you'll lock in the shapes in your head and you'll be able to play all over the neck. That's what used to work for me anyways. I used to always put on a backing track in D minor and just solo all over the neck and eventually, now I kind of have the shapes locked in my head so I know where I'm going on the neck if I'm ascending or descending. So here's a lick that I came up with that helped me kind of join all the scales together. I'm going to play it fast and then I'll break it down and play it slow. So I hope that lick will help you out. That helped me a lot when it came to joining the scales from the bottom of the neck the whole way up to the top. And it sounds kind of cool, so you can actually use it as a solo also if you want. So that's all for today's video. I hope it was beneficial to you. If it was, please hit the like button and drop a comment down below. Also, please subscribe to the channel. And if you like, you can also follow me on Instagram to keep up to date for future videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.